Hey YouTube, yes, your eyes do not deceive you. Do not adjust your screen. It is really me, Cherry Coco. I'm back with another video from the depths of the YouTube dungeon. <laughs> That's what it feels like I've been because I have not done a video in so long. But there's a reason why I haven't done a video in so long because I've been busy and I've been so busy, I now get to celebrate and guess what your girl is celebrating. Yes, I have a shop on Etsy and I just reached a small milestone. You started the title. It ain't no joke. A hundred sales on Etsy. Yay! A round of applause for your girl because I put myself out there. I did it. Start up on a little small business, entrepreneurship, whatever you want to call it. Hustle. Put my items out there on Etsy. Made me a little shop. And I did it. I put myself out there. I put my products out there. I promoted myself. And I sold. Right now, I'm at 100 sales. Yes, 100 sales. And I can't tell you how proud of myself. I started... Well, let me, let me start from the beginning, okay? Get comfortable. I mean, it's not a super long story, actually. It's not long at all. Very, I wanna say basic because I'm not going to be putting myself down. That's not what we're doing. We promote black girl magic here. Um, your girl did a thing, so we're gonna keep it at that. But, not an uncommon tale, I should say. Um, so what had happened was, I was bored during the pandemic. Um, I was the girl who was used to going out to happy hour after work or just, you know, pit around the stores and shopping and whatnot. I like to window shop and I like to pick up things here and there. I'm kind of a, a compulsive impulse buyer, I guess you can say. A nice way of putting it. So wasn't able to do that during the pandemic because we were in a shutdown. So I was like, I need something to buy my time. So in March, um, in the midst of this, I bought me a small Cricut Joy, which I love dearly, and I began to make things for my grandbabies. And I started making onesies and little hats and t-shirts and stuff like that. Um, yeah, I got a new grandbaby, and he's adorable. Um, so that's two for me. And I started doing that, and I was showing it to my friend. She's like, oh, these are, you know, these are really cute. You should start selling them or whatever, whatever. And I was like, ah, oh, that's not really, blah, blah, blah really me but I start making more and more and then I start getting into the adult t-shirts started making some for me my son my husband and yada 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 um and then I was like I have an abundance of these things I'm not really doing a lot with them because that was my hobby I couldn't go nowhere couldn't go out anywhere so I was just making 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 so I was like why the hell not just use this little quick joy make my products put them out there see what people like mm, mm, mm. they like them they like them they don't they don't and somebody bought a shirt and said so, well actually the first thing they bought was a decal somebody bought a decal then somebody bought a shirt then somebody bought a mask then somebody bought a shirt then somebody bought another shirt then somebody bought another shirt. Then somebody bought a mask. And I started putting myself, my things on. Then I started putting my products on Macari. Somebody bought a shirt. Somebody bought a mask. Somebody bought some stickers. Somebody bought this. Somebody bought that. So I was like, okay, let me try to put it on the Facebook market page. And I, in the same thing. So I was like, okay your girl out here running some type of business out here making a little bit of coin for herself you know making the money back that she spent on this joy which wasn't expensive by the way um it was about when i bought them they they're on sale now but when i bought them they weren't on sale it was like 179 i believe i bought for the full price but um i do not regret buying it at all about a month ago though a little over a month ago about the air too and now your girl thinks she all that and she's doing more stuff and it's getting kind of out of hand i got a lot of stuff that is not out on my shop that i've got sitting in the back because i still have to take pictures and 
you know, do product descriptions for them and things like that. So you're about to see a lot more stuff on um, in my shop right now. I believe there's only 20, I know there's only 26 items active in my shop. There's more items available. Well, they're not available because I don't have them active because I stopped with some to push some others and to do all that. So yes, 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 yes. Your girl has an Etsy shop. She reached a milestone, um, 100 sales on Etsy. I forget how many on Macari. I forget how many on Facebook. Um, I also been doing, you know, kind of good in the community as well. I want you guys though to help me reach an even bigger milestone. Check out my store, So So Deaf, on Etsy. That is So So Deaf, D E F. <laughs> But it's not completely spelled like the record label. No, it's not. It's a play on words. It's so as in S-E-W-S-O-D-E-F. That's S-E-W as in so, because I do like the so. S-E-W-S-O-D-E-F. That is the name of the shop on Etsy. That is also um, the shop on Macari. But the Instagram is a tad bit different because I was strictly doing decals at first. The Instagram is the gal for decals, and I will put it somewhere up here across the screen, across the screen, across my face, whatever. So you guys can go follow me on Instagram, um, like some of the pictures, click the link, shop, support your girl. Um, the masks are funny. I think they're absolutely hilarious. The t-shirts, I like them. Other people seem to like them. I got a lot of five-star reviews. Um, if I remember correctly, I'm, I have 30, I'm 36 shop favorites and 23, 22, 23, five star reviews and read the reviews as well. Um, I'm not just putting out anything. I'm putting my blood, sweat and tears into this. Um, this is what I like to do. This helps me. This is my therapy going through this pandemic going through what the country is going through right now it helps me redirect my focus somewhere else um i know what we're going through is important and we all need to pay attention and i do but sometimes it's just a little too much for me so when i get an order or if i'm ran out of things and i need to make something else this it really helps me take the focus off of just the utter tragedy that we have become today is just so i want you to help me reach that other milestone which is a thousand sales on my etsy shop again so so deaf s-e-w-s-o-d-e-f on etsy and check out the instagram i think you guys might like it oh check out my regular instagram too um cherry coco that's all my private instagram cherry coco if it's private I don't think it's private. If it is, I'll have to take it off because I promote my YouTube videos on there and that would be stupid to do that on a private page. Dumb. So anyway, yeah, so check out the Instagram, the gal for decals. Check out the Etsy shop, So So Deaf, and just check out all the merchandise that I have. Support a black business. Support your girl. Click on something. There is a promo code, um, YouTube, you put the promo code in there and you'll get 10% off of your purchase. So shop, 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 shop. What else you got to do? Spend your money on me. No, don't spend your money on me. Spend your money <laughs> with me. I ain't trying to be nobody's sugar baby. I'm a little longer than two for that. But anyway, go ahead. Check your girl out. Support your girl. Um, Again, um, I am not participating in Vlogmas. This is not, I said Vlogmas. No, I am not participating in Vlogtober. This is not a Vlogtober vlog um this is not a vlogtober video this is just me coming on here promote myself be my own brand ambassador ambassador because i can't afford nobody else <laughs> right now let me put that in there because i'm speaking things into existence manifesting praying meditating doing all those things sis yes being the queen that i am no but seriously um get more serious about it yeah follow check it out see what you like oh we was talking about 
blocktober um like i said before i don't know if i said it before because i'm kind of rambling a little bit i'm just waiting for my husband to get home but uh vlogmas last year taught me a lesson that um vlogging every day and trying to upload every day and edit every day is not the move not when i'm trying to do 18 other things in my life no and the funny thing about it is uh last season for vlogmas i wasn't doing a damn thing i ain't really have much to vlog boring as all get out now that i'm actually doing some real some real shit some real mess i ain't got time <laughs> You talk about your girl being booked and busy. I mean, I'm not really booked, but I'm busy. So, yeah. Uh, Cash 22-ish? I don't know. But anyway, um, like I said, go on, look it up, and shop. Again, the promo code YouTube, 10% off for everybody. All right? Well, it was nice talking to you guys and seeing you again. I truly do miss sitting down in front of this camera with this bright ass light shining on my big ass forehead just all the oil just glistening through the camera and talking to y'all and i hope y'all miss my big shiny fat face as well <laughs> you will be seeing more of it because i am gonna get back on my youtube thing because this truly is my first love sorry but it is all right you guys have a good night stay blessed and stay safe bye